Hello, everybody. How is everybody? Welcome back to another live stream. How are you guys? Today, we are going to be playing some cozy Animal Crossing New Horizons. Hello. And look, it's a nice rainy day in game. <laughs> That's good. That's perfect for the cozy vibes. Missed you. Missed you guys too. I'm sorry, you guys. I've been a little bit under the weather lately. I'm trying to get on top of things. Um, I don't know how long today's stream is going to be, uh, but uh, we'll, we'll just go for as uh, long as we feel like it today. But yeah, thank you guys so much for being here and tuning in. Oh, who is singing right now? Oh, it's Marina. Marina? That's their name, right? It's been a while since we've played <laughs> Animal Crossing, isn't it? Aw, they got such a cute little voice. Okay, let's get into it, you guys. <clears throat> but yeah, how have you guys been? Everybody been busy? Been doing good? Morning voice? <laughs> yeah, it is morning voice right now. I rolled out of bed and I'm just like, Renvaders, Renvaders, let's go, let's go. <laughs> uh, yeah, busy working? Mm. Well, that's, I mean, a little bit of busy is good, right? Hi, Isabel. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that for the whole time. <laughs> right now on Alienation, it is 1.06 p.m. on Thursday. Mm -hmm. March 21st. Do you guys know what that means? <gasps> There's only like four more days. Till, I don't know, some someday. It's not important or anything, you know, like just some random day. <laughs> Four days, yeah, till my birthday. I'm keen, I'm keen. It's just gonna be a uh, a chill birthday, I think. Uh, Rosamie, thank you so much for the raid. Thank you so much. Welcome in, everybody. Hello, welcome the rosebuds. Hello. Do the rose rosebuds need to be watered like the renvaders? Where's my water bottle? Dang. It's in the other room. How are you guys doing? How is your stream? What did you play? <laughs> Hello, Wozumi. Wozumi sama. <laughs> water? Water? <laughs> I guess that's a yes, I need it. Rosami was freaking it. She was freaking it? Was she krillin' it? That's whenever I go to a Rosami stream, I hear her saying something about like krillin. And I'm like, <laughs> Wait, is Rosamie's favorite Dragon Ball Z character Krillin? Because she says Krillin so much. <laughs> She's about to Voltorb? Oh. Oh, freaking it for the 3D? Yeah. Oh my God. I would be freaking it too. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I'm so excited for your 3D. I don't know if uh, I think she might have hopped off it, but I'm excited for it. I hope everybody else is too. <clears throat> She's actively Voltorbing these days. <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> She's Voltorbing. <laughs> the 3D making her go crazy. Yo, I'm so... I'm excited. I'm excited. Petra's one was so awesome, wasn't it? Now we're all excited for Rosamie. Yeah. But thank you again for the raid. Enjoy your stay, you guys. We're just playing some comfy Animal Crossing today. You know, just keeping keeping the vibes nice and, and relaxed. So yeah, let's uh, let's play. I don't have any big news to share with you all today, but I would like to touch on one seasonal topic. When I was taking my morning walk today, very good. Isabel touches grass, you guys. That's very good. I hope that inspires all of you as well. <laughs> I noticed that some goodies had fallen from the trees. What could be more fall than that? <laughs> Sometimes when you shake trees, they'll surprise you by dropping it. <clears throat> acorns or even pine co cones sorry my voice so get on out there folks and shake things up shake shake that reminds me I sound out a recipe for a tree's bounty little tree oh we can craft a tree I look forward to seeing your trees that's all for today have fun out there thank you Isabel 
Let's craft a tree, you guys. Let's let it grow, let it grow. Oh my god, look at my hair. Wait, is this my regular hair? Oh. There it is! Okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember our hair being this scraggy. Scraggly or whatever. Oh, no. We got mail! <gasps> Mom sent us something. My dear Ren, ah, that brief time of year when nature is too indecisive to be either too hot or too cold. If only my own indecisiveness was this enjoyable. Should I bring a jacket or no? You should bring a jacket, Mom. You should. You know what? Bring a jacket if you, if you don't know whether you're gonna bring a jacket or not. Whether you should. Just bring it and you can tie it around your waist. You know like how you did like back in school? You just tie it around your waist. Yeah. And you can look cool like that, yeah. <laughs> did anyone do that? Back in school. Let's see, what do we got? Mom's cushion. Mom's mom. Oh, that's cute. Thanks, mom. Thanks, mom. My butt's gonna love this. Okay, let me pick that up. How do I pick it up? There we go. Alright, very nice. <laughs> Don't expose our fashion. <laughs> hey. You guys are fashionistas, okay? Update from Resident Services. To celebrate opening the new Resident Service building, we have lots of new Miles Redemption items available. Plus, we now have a new service for Nook Miles Plus members to earn five times more miles. Oh my gosh. A commemorative gift is attached. Mmm. <clears throat> five times more miles. What? What? What is this? Nook Miles ticket. <gasps> nice. So we can, wait, Nook Miles ticket? Is that a island hopping ticket? My brain isn't working very well <laughs> today, <laughs> sorry. Yo, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Welcome to the alienation. Thank you. Yo, we're B rank for our house. We gotta keep expanding you guys. Let's go to Nook and be in more debt. Enjoy the included gift. Thank you very much. I will. Happy home. Congratulations, blah, 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 words. I'm just gonna take the gift, you know. Here's a little gift for all your help. Oh yeah, this is from Gulliver. Donald Duck washed up on the beach. I remember that. What did they give us? Let's have a look. Uh, Canis, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Welcome to the alienation. Thank you. Okay, this is from Donald. Let's see what he got us. A sunbreak. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! Look at us! Oh my gosh! I look good! Hey! Hey! How do I... How do I do my little poses? How do I do my little poses in this game again? <laughs> I've forgotten all the... Oh, there they are. Here we go. <laughs> Very nice. I love it. I love it. Um. Ah. Damn it. Hermoso. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Alright. I look great. I like it. It's protecting us from the rain as well, you guys. So this is perfect. <gasps> we got our Nintendo items as well. <gasps> Finally came. Okay. Put down the goal pole. Ready? <gasps> look! It's huge! Oh my god. Whoa! Look at that. Dang! I want to jump on this pole and slide down it like Mario. And keep moving on with my life. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> jump on it? I wish I could. Hang on. Let's see. Oh! You actually can't... Okay, that makes it 10 times cool. Okay, no wonder it was so expensive. Look at this. That's awesome! Oh, I love it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to put this somewhere. Uh, Where do we want to put it? Do we want to put it, like, next to our house? Like, maybe like... Ah, uh, no, no, no. 
Hmm. Like here or something? Maybe? I don't know where to put it actually. Okay, we're gonna have a think about that. Uh, put it on the top of the island. Yeah, we could put it up there as well. Okay, we got our thwomp as well. Let's have a look at this. Oh! He's facing. Oh my god! <laughs> Let's turn him around. Okay, face the Ren Vaders, alright? There we go. Look at that scary face. I mean, that beautiful face. Oh, that's cool. It's got. It's like motion sensor, just like in the real game, you know? Cool. So you don't actually interact with it, it's um, it just like does it whenever you're close. That's cool! Maybe it can be a, the bodyguard to our house or something, you know? I'll put it right at my entrance. <laughs> just block the entrance. <laughs> really? Perfect. No one's getting into my house now, you guys. There we go. Yeah, okay, nice. I like that. All right, let's go. <laughs> Perfect. All right, let's see what we got in Nook's Cranny right now. Let's have a look, shall we? Nice rainy vibes. I love it. You guys like rainy uh, rainy uh, days as well, you guys? Who doesn't, right? Hello. Welcome to Nook's Cranny. Hello. Hi, you guys. What do you got for me? What do you got for me? You like my hat, by the way? Ren, welcome. Welcome. What do you need today? Uh, do I have turnips? The current price is 136 bells per turnip. That's good, isn't it? Wait, I need to... Do I have turnips? I don't think I have any. Shit. That is high, yeah. What are you offering? Offering. Uh, wait, no, I don't want to sell. What am I doing? Hang on, hang on. Let's look in the... Okay, so we got... Ooh, what's this? A little cream and sugar. Aw, that's cute. We got a little kettle here as well. Let's see, that's 500 bells. Hmm, I'll pass for now, actually. Hang on, let me look at... I'm just... I'm just browsing. I'm just that annoying... <clears throat> My voice is fucked today. Sorry, you guys. Let me get a drink of water. <clears throat> Mm. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> uh, what is this? Uh, we got the... <gasps> oh my god. It's the exercise ball that Petra had for her 3D. <laughs> 1,000 bell. Oh, that's kind of pricey. <clears throat> but it's worth it. Let's get it. Hell yeah. Now we can exercise and bounce on a ball together, you guys. Let's go. Curious about what's in the cabinet what do we have today. <clears throat> no, don't die. It's okay. My voice is just a little scuffed. I've been uh, I've been using my voice a lot <clears throat> offline, working on stuff. So uh, let's see. Pitfall. Uh, wait. Anything we? Oh, we got the wallpapers and stuff. We got a pink painted. What? That's cute. That's pretty cute. Red perforated board wall hmm brown brick wall hmm cooking yeah a little bit of cooking offline that's right you guys you'll see you'll see um no i'm not feeling any of those things actually <laughs> where do i get uh oh see you guys bye bye thank you they didn't even say anything about my hat. What the heck? What the hell? Donald Duck gave me this hat. Okay, let's have a look. What are we looking for right now? There should be... Um, are there more villagers and stuff? There should be. How are these fires still alight in the rain? That's not a question. Okay, let's go. Let's have a look. Bah, 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 bah. Is that a weed? Is that a we- Did I get it? I think I got it. Okay, good. Whew. That was gonna piss me off. <laughs> it's magic, don't question it. Hey everyone, on March 25th, we'll be saying happy birthday to Ren- 
Oh my god, they remembered. What the heck? So prep those party hats and get into the celeb celebratory spirit, folks. Tom, no oh my god. Ugh. This is the best island ever. I'm so happy I moved here. What the heck? Surrounded by all of my happy, happy animal friends that remember my birthday. Oh my gosh. What the heck? What more could you want, you know? Hello. Wait, have we seen it upgraded like this? Is this the first time we've seen it like this? Wait, it... Is Isabel new? Wait, <laughs> I'm forgetting what happened in the last one, you guys. First time? Yeah, it is! Okay, I was like, wait. I didn't even react any differently when Isabel started at the, at the very beginning. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, Ren, hello, hello. Welcome to the new, improved resident services tent. Oh, did I say tent? Of course, I meant building. And we couldn't have built it without your help. And your money. There's one... This, this man is bleeding me dry, you guys. There's one other topic I'd like to bring up. Looks at Isabel. We need new support staff for a new building, so Isabel is here to take good care of us. Let's go! I love Isabel! What the heck? I can't believe I didn't even react. I'm sorry, Isabel. My brain was mush. <laughs> it still is. Um, Alright. You're Ren, right? Mr. Nook has told me all about you. I'm sure you know loads more about this island and its residents than I do, Ren. But I'm already smitten with island life, so you can count on me to give my absolute best. I love her. She's so cute. <laughs> Look at her little bell. It's so cute. And there you have it. Isabel and I will split up duties and uh, here to support you, to better support you all. I can't read. Broadly speaking, I'll take care of anything related to homes or other construction issues. Isabel will help you with general island matters and resident support. Uh, sit at the appropriate counter when you need help and we'll rush over in two swishes of a raccoon's tail. That was a very cute little saying. <laughs> in fact, have a seat now and we can introduce you to some new services. Now, with that out of the way, I have something I'd like your help with. Oh, of course you do. When you have a moment, please sit at my counter. I hope I can count on your continued support of alienation and our new resident services building. Okay, what if I never sit at his counter though? You know, then I never have to... <laughs> What's the part? Let's grab these. Take the iron nuggets. The iron nuggets. Hello, Isabel! Look, move over. I want to talk to Isabel. Oh, Ren! Here you are already! At this counter, I can help you with both general issues and issues you may face with other residents. We can delve into the details when specific concern arises. No need to worry about that right now. It's okay, Isabel. I just want to chat. You know, I just want to hang out. That's all. She's so cute. I just want to wish you, wish you, wish you. <laughs> but since you're here, I may as well ask, do you have any specific concerns at the moment? Uh, uh shh. Do I? Oh, this is so exciting. My first official request. She's so happy. She's such a hard worker, you guys. Look at this. Ahem. I'm sorry. <laughs> that wasn't professional, was it? Now then. <laughs> How can I help you today? Um. Oh. We can change the island tune. You got. Oh my gosh. It's time. We can. Yo. We're making blue sugar. Our tune for the island. Holy shit! Yo, I wanted this for a while, actually. I'm certain you've heard the current Alienation Island tune. You really can't miss it. It plays in multiple locations across the island, and it reminds us residents uh, of the time. I think the current anthem is a classic, but there's always room to change. And improve, blah, blah, blah. You don't have to be a musician to compose a tune. Uh, so if you have any ideas for a new one, let me know. That's true. That's very true. Okay. So this is the current one. <laughs> what is this one?
<laughs> so, okay, ready, you guys? Let's make a blue sugar. Hang on, what's the highest one? Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll do it on C. There'll need to be a break, right? Hang on a sec. <laughs> Wait, how do you do breaks and stuff? Oh, you hold it like that. Okay. All right. Da, da, da. Da. Yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> he is learning. I'm learning, you guys. I'm going to make it happen. Hang on. Is, it, is there a way to do it faster? Ba, 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 ba. Maybe if we hold this one. Ba, 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 ba. And then this one is a break. And then it goes. Da, 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 da. <laughs> da, da, da. Da, and then this one's hold. Da, da. Da, da. Well, that sounded a bit scuffed. <laughs> That's kind of cute. <laughs> Kinda, it's out of time and stuff, but I, I guess it kind of works. Hang on, is there a way that I can make it like a bit? That <laughs> sounds so scuffed. What if I do this? Nah, I like the little break. <laughs> okay, we'll do that. That's kind of cute. Well, I do have a little musical knowledge. Allow me to preview the tune you created. Oh my god, she sings! Yo! Isabel version of Blue Sugar. What the heck? Can I hear that again, please? Hang on. That's so cute. <laughs> How inspiring. Your new island tune makes me so proud to call Alienation my home. Now then, we'll start using it right away. I hope you enjoy it when you're out and about. Can you sing it again? Fuck. Only one time. Maybe she's shy. That's okay. Uh, change the island flag. I don't think we even have a flag. Do we? Uh, discuss a resident. Oh, is this how I can kick residents off the island? Oh, gosh. I can make a complaint. It's messed up. <laughs> That's messed up. What the heck? Change island flag. Want to change the flag? The one in front of the airport too? Fantastic. Our flag is the physical embodiment embodiment of everything alienation represents to folks on the island. Okay. It's a little dated. Do you have something else in mind? Uh, what is it currently? Do we even have one? Hmm. Um, uh, I mean, I don't, maybe we should make a custom one later. I don't know. Did you change your mind? Hope you can come up with something else. Okay, I'm good for now. All right, then, if there's anything I can assist you with in the future, please don't hesitate to ask. Thank you. Yay, we've got Isabel, and we got a new tune, you guys. Let's go. What am I doing right now? Nook Miles? What did I just get? 
What did I get? Oh, <gasps> dream house. A home you built yourself. You guys, should I put myself in more debt? <laughs> should I upgrade the house again? What do you guys think? Or should we enjoy... No, we're still in debt right now, I think, actually. Well, hello there, Ren. Your home is much roomier, yes? <laughs> Why not? Uh, it's nice to have even a little extra space. Which brings us to... The cost of your rem remodel. One th okay, yeah, we're already in debt. Wait, I haven't even checked out the expansion of the house. What the hell? Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff to do. Uh, please make your payments using the Nook Stops ABD feature as you've done before. As always, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. That's all you wanted to talk about? The money? That's all he cares about, you guys. He doesn't give a shit about us. What the heck? Once per day, accessing the blah, blah, blah. Let's take the Nook Miles. Where am I going to get... Um, uh, Where do I get turnips from? from? We need to be a millionaire. Mr. Flamingo? What is this? A bandage? Uh, high tea. Oh, cool. Some short... They're not orange, though. So close! They could have been orange shorts, damn. KK Synth. Ooh. Okay. I think we've got, like, a lot of cool Mario items, honestly. Yeah. The high tea is so cute. Yeah, it's pretty cute, actually. All right. See you guys later. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> We're going to go check out our house. They even have orange shorts in the game? I would assume so. You know? Oh, that's right. Okay, thank you. Um, at ease. Okay, <laughs> let's go inside. I forgot I put that guy down. All right, let's have a look at our new layout. Our new home. What? Oh, a cockroach. Can I catch it? Can I cat? Where's my bug net? I can't do the bug net inside. Oh, do I have to squish it? No, I don't want to squish it. That's messed up. Where's my little... Where's my little... Bug... Container. You guys, I've got a bug container. That I usually... I scoop bugs up and spiders up and I put them outside. Do I really have to step on it? <sighs> okay. Fine. I'm sorry, little guy. Look, his soul leaves his body. That is so sad. What the heck? Okay. Is that good? I think it's fixed now. Why, though? What do you mean, why, though? Why wouldn't I? You're just a little guy. They're not trying to hurt anybody. Oh, there he is. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry, but the renovators don't like bugs. Sorry. Oh my god, why am I cheering over its death? That is so messed up. All the pesky cockroaches are gone. I feel so much better. What the heck? It's messed up. Okay, let's, uh, let's, hang on. Let's, oh shit, no! Put that back down, put that back down. What the heck? What have I done? That's the best part of the entire house. Okay, how do I... How do I do the layout again? Fuck! I'm messing everything up! <laughs> Hang on a sec. This button? No. This button. This button. There it is. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, make this room a bit nicer, shall we? I put my bed over there. We can separate that there. That's nice. Uh, we got the little corner. For the renovators here with the grass. <laughs> the little grass corner. There you go. Very nice. <laughs> can put that there. Uh, the star. Where do we want the star? Mm. Oh, it leaves like a trail of sparkles. That's kind of cute. Put that. Mm. Put that there. Yeah. Nice. Wow, we got a lot more space now. This is looking good. 
Look at this. Look at that. Wait, hang on. I need to put that over the top of my bed. Like this. Ready? Can I... Hello? Can I... How do I select the... Eh? <sighs> Go up on the wall! How the heck do I select it? Maybe I'll just put my bed here. <laughs> yeah, that works. I'll press the plus thingy. Huh? Oh, okay, okay. Let's put this right here in the middle. Yeah, nice. That looks good. Yeah, look at my bedroom. Let's go to bed. <laughs> Never get over that. Should I get some sleep? Nah, I'll just lie down. All right. Cool. Was that really worth all the extra money? I I don't know. I don't know. It's a bit more space. <laughs> okay, you guys. Let's let's get some stuff now. All right. Where is my? Uh... Okay, this is gonna be the money rock. I feel it. Ready? Ready? Three. Two, one, money! Ah, it's just regular stone. I didn't even get much stuff. What the heck? <laughs> Why are there so many Doritos on the ground in Animal Crossing? Look at them. Look at them all. There's triangles everywhere. I don't get it. Why? Okay, this is the money rock, you guys. Whoops. Whoops. Okay. And go three, two, one. Money rock! Ah. Happy uh, late St. Patrick's Day. Happy late St. Patrick's Day. Hope you had a good one. Dude, this sombrero is the best thing that was ever given to me. For today. For the rainy weather today. Not a speck of water on my clothes. <laughs> I am perfectly sheltered right now. Oh, what is this? Fossil? <gasps> Look, I dug up a fossil. Nice. Heck yeah. I got a recipe. Oh shit. <laughs> Pick it up. <laughs> it's this one. Message in a bottle. Dear anonymous reader, whilst taking a much needed hot bath, my mind dreamed up the most fabulous idea for a DIY recipe. I cannot help... Wait, I cannot keep this idea to myself, so I placed it in a bottle. It would please me if you made it. Violet. Oh. Who's Violet? Imperial Pot. Ooh. Nice. Thank you very much. Thank you kindly. I'll check out that recipe later. All right. We got any like sharks and stuff in the water yet? When can I start? <laughs> Forgot I put this hazard sign out the front. Of this is Bud's house, right? Is he home? Oh, he is. She's a gorilla, really? Oh. Hey, Bud, what you working on? What you working on, buddy? Ben, you're back! How'd your octuple marathon go? What? Why what? What? You didn't run an octuple marathon? Ha! <laughs> I knew you'd bring me if it was something like that. <laughs> oh. What are you working on, bud? <laughs> Woo! I nearly sprained my creativity. What do you think? What is it? You're not gonna believe it. I made a stacked wood wall. Oh shit. I was out jogging the other day and somewhere around the 53rd mile. It 53 mile bud. You've got to slow down my man. Holy shit. Inspiration just hit me. I think that was fatigue. Or it could have been dehydration. <laughs> Either way. Check it out and stay hydrated. That's a good tip. 
building it was like a hard workout routine. And you know I'm all about sharing my routines. So what do you say? You want to get built making yourself a stacked wood wall? Oh, sure. Yeah, actually. Well, I could. Or I could give you this paper that I wrote on recipe on. I vote for the paper. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Wait, so I can have a wood wall now? <clears throat> that would look pretty cool, actually. Fucking voice, man. <clears throat> I'm gonna have some water, actually. Take Bud's advice. Bud is our, uh, our health guide. He's our, like, coach. Alright. <clears throat> Thank you, Bud! See you later! <laughs> But as a renovator. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now we can. Yeah, stacked wood wall. Kind of want to see what that looks like. It sounds like it could be good. I really like, um, like wood, uh, like wood walls and wood, like floors and, and furniture and stuff. I don't know. I, I like the, I like that aesthetic. What do you, what do you guys think? Do you like that sort of thing? Dug up a fossil, thank you very much. T-Rex. T-Rex skull, come on. Please. Please, please, please. Treehouse vibe? <laughs> now that you mention it, yeah, actually. I do like treehouse vibe. <laughs> I like it too, seems more cozy somehow. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know, maybe I just grew up around that kind of... Aesthetic, you know, homes like that. Where's the money? I don't know. Where the heck is it? Where's the money rock? Oh, I found the money tree. Hey, we dig up a thousand bells, and you know what? We're gonna plant it right back down because we pay it forward in alienation. Bury in the hole. Boop. There we go. Nice. All right. What am I looking for right now? What am I looking for? I don't know. I don't really have a goal. I'm just kind of looking around. <laughs> the money tree. All right. Oh! This is... It's Audie's house. Oh my god, that's right. We have Audie in our island. I'm so happy. I almost forgot. Okay, let's go visit Audie, you guys. Let's pay her a visit. Maybe she'll like our hat. All right, all right. Adi, 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 Adi. <gasps> her house is so cute. Look at this place. Look at this place. Look at her little pink vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I love this place. Hey, Adi, how you doing? Oh, Ren, it's been a while. How are you? Were you away practicing your favorite hobby? Window shopping? How does she know that we like window shopping? Huh? That's not your hope? No, it is. I do that a lot. <laughs> Whatever, you shouldn't have disappeared without saying anything. Oh! Oh shit, she's angry. Audie, I'm sorry! Please forgive me. Now you have to make up for lost time by hanging out with me. We've got a lot of fun to catch up on. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's go hang out. What do you think of my hat, by the way? You like it? She's like, uh... <laughs> uh doesn't like it. Hey, it's super great to see you. What do you need? What's the latest? Oh yeah, I totally forgot. Black Hole Skull Beast uh, 7 is on TV tonight. Full on horror. She likes horror? Horror movies are totes my jam. Skull Beast 3 kept me awake for a week. Uh, 7 is gonna be crazy. Oh my gosh. You guys... I've been kind of lately really uh, hooked on like scary stuff again. I don't know. I'm going through another scary, uh, you know, like content phase, I guess. I don't know. I just get in the mood for them sometimes. You know, it usually lasts like a couple weeks. <laughs> I don't know why. Like what? Oh, just like scary stories and stuff. I love watching... Um, I love watching YouTube channels that uh, that 
you know, that recount like, well, they say that they're true stories and stuff, but I don't know. You never know, right? <laughs> what people on the internet can lie? No way. Holy shit. I can't believe it. Oh, let's get that weed. Get that weed. Get out of here. No weeds on alienation. <laughs> right, who lives here again? Can't remember. Is this Marina? This might be Mar Yes, it is. Okay. I like this house. This one's... Uh, it's nice. It's, it's quaint. <laughs> Did you hear the jingle, you guys? That sounds great. Ren, oh wow! It's great to see you again. Where have you been all this time? I dropped by your place to look for you, but you were never home. I'm sorry. I was touching grass. I bet you went on a secret mission. Yeah, to some place exotic, but filled with danger at every turn. Sorry about that. I've been on kind of an adventure novel kick. Uh, welcome back, blurp. Did you just blurp in my face again? What's up, blurp? Stop! Hey! Let's check. I'm trying to get to know the community better. That's why I've been going around asking everyone questions lately. Look at their jumper, it's so cute. <laughs> I've read that the right questions can reveal someone's personality. With that in mind... What's your favorite kind of music to listen to, blurp? My favorite kind of music to listen to? Uh... I like a lot of stuff, but I think... I like electronic music a lot. And pop and stuff. There it is, pop! I don't listen to music? What kind of option is that? What the fuck? I'm so glad some folks are snobby about pop music fan- da Yo, we were talking about this a little while ago. That is true. We should compare top 10 lists sometimes. You know what? I like Marina. You guys? So what if they kind of look like Birdo? So what? They're cool. They're cool in, in my book. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Finally he accepts her. <laughs> Well, you know, it took time, but we got there in the end, right? What the hell are all these weeds, man? I guess it is raining pretty heavy. Okay. The only grass I want on this island is this. This stuff. This fake grass for the run. <laughs> no, we get all this, all this nice grass. You know, we just don't want weeds. That's the only thing. Guys, there's a difference between nice grass and weeds. You know? What is this? What is this? Where are all the sharks, man? I want a shark. Okay, I'm gonna start cleaning up this place. He accepts the ocean birdo cousin! <laughs> yeah, they're cool, I guess. <laughs> I guess they can stay. You know. Oh! We got the money tree? Heck yeah. Let's get some moolah. Boom, boom, boom. Let's grab the apples. It's time to start collecting stuff, you guys. Were there any more villagers that were gonna be here? I can't remember. I honestly can't remember. Okay, I do not want um, to be stung by bees again today. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I have to be careful. Okay, it's time to get some, uh, <clears throat> some lunch for the renovators. All right, getting all these weeds. Cause I know that you guys, you know, like, if you like eating grass, you love eating weeds, you know? It's just more, you know? It's like out of control grass. <laughs> Traumatized by the bees. I literally, dude, I, I've gotten stung by the bees so many times in this game. It's ridiculous, you know? Wait, he's feeding us weeds? Uh, what's wrong with that? I thought you guys like anything that even slightly resembles grass. Look! It's just grass with more substance, you guys. Thought you would approve. Oh, so many grass. Yum, yum. <laughs> you see? You see? Most of you guys don't even care. It's fine. And it's nice and moist from the rain, you guys. Mm-mm-mm. Doesn't that sound nice? Mmm. Moist grass. 
Using the word moist to describe something doesn't make it sound very <laughs> appetizing, actually. <laughs> sounds kind of gross. Oh shit, I picked the flowers, whoops. Moist grass. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. Do you ever just look out at the ocean in Animal Crossing and just look how beautiful it is. Look at all those islands. Think about all the other villages, um, you know, that are out there. Think about that. Look, maybe Vanta lives out there on that island, right over there in the distance. I wonder if he does. Maybe we should, we could try swimming to it. I gotta go see Vanta one day. <laughs> in Animal Crossing. It'll happen, it'll happen one day. A whole new world. <laughs> Swim over? Yeah. I'll doggy paddle over you guys. <laughs> Did I just hear someone? I think my Wait. Did Marina come out? Let's see. Oh! She's got a little... Hang on, let's see. <laughs> She's got a little pink rain jacket on. That's so cute. Let's try not to let this rain dampen our spirits. Blurp. I want to chat again. I have a question for you. Don't overthink your answer. You're about to enjoy a cup of tea. So what kind of tea are you having? Mm, usually for me it'd be green tea. Oh, it's not an option. Well, out of this one, chai tea definitely. I've read that how you answer is supposed to say something about how things are going in your life. Oh, I think choosing chai tea means you try to be sweet to everybody, but lately you really need to vent. Oh my gosh. Does that sound about right? Uh, kinda, maybe. <laughs> Sometimes we all need to let loose and de-stress, blurb. I think I need to de-stress, that's for sure. <laughs> Damn, Marina got me. She called me out. <laughs> I do need to de-stress a little bit, actually. That is true. Thank you, Marina. Alright, let's get some more weeds up the top here. Marina is in your walls. <laughs> How did she know? Oh my god. Oh, wait! Let's go see Red! Let's go get some more legit paintings. The ones you guys are so worried about. Don't worry, okay? Right, we got this. Are you guys? Don't touch anything while we're in here, okay? Oh. <laughs> well, if it isn't my favorite cousin, glad to have you back abro uh, aboard the Jolly Red's treasure trawler. Oh, store policy, I know it. You know it. We have a limit of one art piece per customer per day. Choose wisely. Mm. Okay. Well, there's the Mona Lisa. What the heck is this? Oh my gosh. We got a punching bag, a beach ball. This one is pretty amazing. Look at this. I won't lie. An awful lot of folks have been asking me about buying that great statue there. But maybe the price scared them off. So I'll sell it to you for 4,980 bells. Oh my gosh. Deal of the fall. You in? Mm, well, this statue is wearing clothes. I don't really... I don't really get clothed statues. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna probably have to pass. I'm sorry. I get it. It's a big decision. And you're a little bitch. Come back later. Hey, that was kind of unnecessary, Red. What the heck? Okay, we got the Mona Lisa. That looks legit to me. Let's have a closer look. You could just feel the aura on that famous painting, huh? I mean, you couldn't buy that kind of aura. Well, you could, and you should. Let me help you out. <laughs> With my cousin's discount. Or the, he sells everything for this. Okay, um... I want a closer look. Wait, what is that face? What is that face? No, no, no. That's not legit. Look at that face. They're like smiling. They're like smug about it. That is totally fake. <laughs> that is not... 
Is that the real thing? No, definitely not. Admiring the detail. Can't blame you. It's extremely detailed. <laughs> Brilliant stuff. And the best part? All that detail could be yours. Yeah, I don't know about that, Red. I understand. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, uh, what's this one? At that wistful painting a lot. Okay, let's have a little closer look. <clears throat> blah, 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 blah. You talk a lot. You are a yapper, Red. Jeez. I want a closer look. Yeah, let's have a look. Alright, what is this one? Oh my god. Is this Lady Gaga? Holy shit. Is that legit, you guys? <laughs> is it legit? The star? This one's fake too? Ah, That's a fake Lady Gaga painting! What the hell? I want the real thing. Nope. Sorry, Red. That's fake. What about this one? <laughs> so you think you want the quaint painting, huh? Believe it or not, that's actually my favorite piece here. Blah, blah, blah. You don't want to sell it. Yes, you do, Red. Come on. Don't lie. Don't lie to me. I want a closer look. Let's have a look. Alright, what is this one? Okay, let's have a look. Alright. Hmm. Yes, hmm. Hmm. Exquisite. Exquisite piece. But is it real? Hmm. 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 It looks pretty legit to me. Fake? You think it's fake? Fake. That's a lot of milk. <laughs> Is that milk? It's fake. Too much pouring. Okay. So everything here is fake? Surely there's got to be one thing that's real, right? What about the... What? Uh, if I have to buy this, I will. Maybe this one is the real deal, though. The statue must be real. Yeah, maybe. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at it. All right. Okay. All right. Um. It looks good to me. Kamehameha. Wait, what? Kamehameha? That's gotta be fake, right? <laughs> Wait, what the heck? At the bottom, you... It's gotta be fake, right? Come <laughs> Or maybe it's real. I don't know. You guys... If, it, if it's real and I'm just stupid just by thinking it's Dragon Ball Z reference, then... It's literally just because I don't know history, I'm sorry. <laughs> so I apologize. It's genuine? You think it's genuine? It's real name for the first king of Hawaii. Really? Oh my gosh. That's actually so cool. I didn't know that. Okay, I'm just an alien. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know history. Okay, so if it's legit then, we buy it. I thought that it was, uh, you know, because he trolls people in the store, so. Okay, all that for... Yeah, let's do it! Ha! You're not gonna regret this. I'll just take those bells from you. Woo! Yep, it's all there. Congratulations, you are now the proud owner of a great statue. It's been a pleasure doing business with you, cousin. And I'll get your art packed up and shipped out tomorrow. Wait, hang on. I actually... I want to Google this. Hang on. So what is it? Uh... Okay, Hawaii? Oh! <gasps> Oh my god! It is! Oh, Gesundheit. You're right! Their name is Kamehameha. Oh, that's awesome. Wow, I didn't know that. Well, you learn something new every day. Well, we got a legit art piece, you guys. Let's go! Alright, thanks for your business, Red. Thank you very much. Alright, I'm out of here. Whoops. We go upstairs. You won't regret it. <laughs> Alright, nice. 
That's really cool, actually. Alright, let's go up. Obvious... Wait. So, obviously... You know, the attack in Dragon Ball Z has nothing to do with that, right? <laughs> now I'm like... Now it's messing with my brain. It's just a coincidence, right? Like... Are they... <laughs> uh, I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, let's grab this, clean up a little bit. Maybe it's a coincidence or inspired. I honest, I don't know. I do not know. My pockets are full! Okay. Renvaders, open up. Okay, open wide. I need to dispose of some of this grass. Swap this. Okay, there we go. Let's keep going. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my gosh. Dispose? Well, yeah. You know. Dispose and... You know. Nu nutritious. You, nutritionalize you guys, you know? Nutritionalize? Is that a word? No, I don't think it is. <laughs> okay, let's grab some apples. Get some apples! We are gonna sell, sell, sell. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. We are basically the trash can. No! They're my little renvaders that I feed and I, and I keep healthy, alright? Oh, my pockets are full. Okay, we're gonna drop it. Let's go sell. <laughs> the trash can invaders. <laughs> no, now I feel bad. Feeding us the moist grass? Yeah! It will hydrate you guys as well. See? Two in one. It's food and drink. Alright. Time to sell. Hey, you guys. Welcome, welcome. What do you need today? I want to sell. Let's get rid of some of these. And then I can go to Blathers and get those fossils as well. Um, the clump of weeds. Do we want to sell the weeds or... Like, save them? Probably just sell them, right? Uh, tree branches. I can get those anytime. Stones, we don't... Oh, well, actually, they probably don't sell for very much. Iron nuggets, we will keep those. Save for leaf. Yeah, we probably should actually. That's a good idea. All right, but I gotta read these. <laughs> All right, how much is gonna be? Three thousand. Okay. There we go. Almost made back our uh, statue. Okay. Nice. Make apple pie. Huh? Make apple pie? No, oh, I would love to. I wish I could make apple pie. Oops. I'll come back here. Ren still keeps the rose in his mouth? Of course! Look at my riz. <laughs> With my sombrero as well. <laughs> hey, it's to keep the rain off of my uh, head. Hey! Deirdre. Perfect fishing weather. Time to catch a few fishies. Whatever. <laughs> Enjoy catching your fishies, Deirdre. Can we eat your hats? What the heck? What the heck? Hey, Blathers, wake up. Whoo! Oh dear, pardon me. Hello, Ren. Dude, I would fall asleep if it was raining outside like that too, actually. Okay, uh, let's uh, assess fossils. Let's do... Boop, 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 boop. Alright. Take a look at these, Blathers. Whew, more than one I see. Ooh, these are rare fossils. <gasps> Each and every one of them. Let's go. Alright, let's see. T-Rex skull. T-Rex, 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 come on. Okay, I'm gonna give them to you. Yeah, 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 I'll donate them. 
What have we got? What have we got? We've got a brachio chest. Okay, cool. An ophthalmo torso. I don't know what that one is. A Danani torso. A trilobite. Oh! Those are like one of the super... Aren't trilobites like one of the oldest living things on planet Earth? Pretty sure, right? Aren't they? Ooh hoo hoo! A trilobite! I never thought I'd lay eyes on such a well-preserved trilobite. Alright, let's have a little listen. History lesson, you guys. Let's do it. Where to begin? Trilobites were ancient and extinct before the dinosaurs ever appeared. It boggles the mind. Who? They were also one of the most successful classes of animal ever, existing for over thir whoa, 300 million years. Some 50,000 species have been identified in sizes ranging from 3 millimeters to over 2 feet. Alas, that is the very limit of my enthusiasm for them, though. They rather look too much like bugs. <laughs> they do, actually. Yeah. Alright, nice. That is so old. It is. Older than me. Holy shit. <laughs> Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Okay, let's hear about this guy. British Blathers is back. <laughs> A day... Denoni? Denoni? How do you say it? Denoni Torso. Alright, let's have a history lesson! Dude, I... Do you guys want to go to a dinosaur museum together? I think that would be so fun, actually. I don't know. I'd like read everything that there is to be read there. <laughs> I don't know about you guys. Would that be fun or would that be boring for you? I'm gonna get some water, actually. <clears throat> Mm. I'll read you out everything on the on the displays and stuff. How's that sound, Red Vaders? You guys don't have to do any thinking, any any reading or anything. You can just you can just listen, you know? And I can geek out about dinosaurs. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> yes, you may not have heard of Deinonychus, but you may have heard of his cousin, the Velociraptor, of course. <laughs> Both were predators, distinguished by their frighteningly huge toe claws. They also had, likely had feathers. Yeah, Velociraptors, they were covered in feathers, weren't they? The main difference between them? Size. Deinonychus was about 7 feet tall and weighed 160 pounds. Little Velociraptor on the other wing was a compact 2 feet tall and weighed only about 33 pounds. That's right, you guys. So, you know, everybody's just like Velociraptor. Think of Jurassic Park, right? And they're they're really big and you know scary like that, and uh, they look like, you know, they they got like, I don't know, like scales. They they got like the lizard kind of look, right? But if you actually look into them, they're really small and they kind of look like big chickens, <laughs> like they, you know, like big like lean chickens uh, with lots of feathers and uh, yeah, very fast, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I've heard that people meeting celebrities are often surprised at how short they are, they are in person. <laughs> yep. That's true, that's true. They look more like chickens, yeah, exactly. And Tyrannosaurus as well, uh, T-Rex apparently... Well, isn't there like... Isn't there speculation in the scientific community that they have feathers as well? Around their neck, apparently. Yeah. Apparently. Apparently. All right. Okay, make a donation. Yeah, but not all dinosaurs were like that, apparently. Not all dinosaurs had feathers and stuff. Okay. We are reading about the Brachiosaurus now, the Brachio. All right. Let me inform me. Please. All right. Brachiosaurus, whose name means arm lizard, eh, what? <laughs> was one of the largest herbivorous dinosaurs. Due to its long front legs and elongated neck, it seems to have specialized in eating plants high up. Alas, in order to support its large size, it likely needed to eat more than, more or less, 
every waking hour. Holy shit. What a ferocious forager it must have been indeed. Yeah. So they just never can stop eating. Holy shit. It's kind of crazy. What kind of existence is that? Just eating non-stop. You can never stop. If you stop, you die. It's crazy. Uh, and what is this? Ophthalmo. Ophthalmo. All right. The torso. I'm gonna go look at these after this. It's fascinating stuff. The adorable Ophthalmosaurus, cutest of all the Ithiosauruses. What makes a large sea-dwelling reptile cute, you may ask? I shall tell you, the eyes. Oh my god. Yo, he, he's falling for this dinosaur, what the hell? Its name means eye lizard, and its face was quite dominated by those great orbs. <laughs> Beside their cultify, cultifyingly, wait, cutifyingly effect, these eyes gave the creature great vision, making it very successful hunting. And no doubt because its big eye, doe eyes, lulled prey into the false sense of security. <laughs> Kendra, thank you so much for the raid. Thank you so much. Welcome on in, everybody. I hope you had a good stream. Thank you. And that is what I have to say about that. Nice. What game did you play? I think that's... Wait, is that everything we got? Yeah, it is. Moth Raid, thank you so much. Welcome in. Hello, my name is Renzodo. I like dinosaurs, and we're going on a dinosaur museum date right now. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> Come with me. I swear, it's not going to be boring. It's going to be super interesting, okay? Look, come with me. Run! Oh, there's the trilobite, see? Trilobite. Donated by Ren. <laughs> yeah. I'm this museum's uh, top supporter. What's this one? Hmm? What is that? I don't know. <laughs> Dino Museum Adventure. Let's go! Alright, let's go see. We donated a couple of uh, torsos here, so... I think I... Is that... Mosasaurus? Uh, no. Oh! Okay, that's the... Ophthalmosaurus. Thalmosaurus. Ophthalmosaurus. Some dinosaur names are hard to say, aren't they? Plesiosaurus. They're fun to say, though. Yeah, ooh! This is the Stegosaurus. <laughs> Momonoki, thank you so much for the super. Thank you, thank you. I had a cold today. <gasps> I hope you feel better. Come back. Drink lots of orange juice. And nice warm tea as well. Ooh, you guys. Look at this. It's starting to come together. I like it. Let's go into the other room. <laughs> waku waku. Waku waku. Oh my god, look at this one. Is this the Brachio? No, that's the Mammoth. Oh. But where's the Brachio one? Oh, that one's coming together. <laughs> I love all the little... This place is so cute. Okay, you guys, where are all of my T-Rex fossils though? What the hell? Okay. We'll get it eventually. T-Rex skull, it's gonna happen one day. Oh, there's the meteor that almost killed us all. Well, not me. You guys. I wasn't here back then. Well, I guess you guys weren't either, but... You know, your kind was here. Like, you evolved from, you know, all those little, uh, you know, creatures that started off on planet Earth, so... Ren, we're still young? <laughs> That's true. Okay. See blathers. Let's not wake him up, okay? It's a nice rainy day. Let's let him enjoy the nice cozy vibes. Hello! Deirdre! Whoa! I kind of thought you'd get out of the rain, but here we both are again. <laughs> what ups? Let's talk. Wow, I had no idea that the new resident services building was gonna be so awesome. I know, right? We got Isabel as well! Living on alienation is really starting to rock. What ups? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what is that? Is that a snail? Ah. 
I caught a snail! Okay, we can give that to Blathers. <laughs> it's just chilling on the rock. The yellow rain coat is cute. You guys... Oh wait, I already did this one. Whoops. The yellow raincoat... It just reminds me of horror movies. Doesn't it? Like horror movies and stuff. I don't know. Yellow... The color yellow just reminds me of that kind of a little bit. Especially raincoats, you know? Little nightmares? Yeah, little nightmares. See? Yes. Shake it. Shake the tree. No bees, please. They use it in a lot of horror movies. Yeah, and like It, right? Little Georgie. Have you guys seen It? I'm gonna catch this thing here. I think I hear a balloon as well. Nice. You haven't seen it? You have seen it? <gasps> Actually, really, I like that movie. Let me grab this. Imagine chilling in the rain and getting abducted by the alien prince and his UFO. I mean, do you want that? Boop. Oh, I missed. Cool. All right, what have we got here? Bum, bum, bum. A pine bonsai tree. Ooh. <laughs> I wouldn't mind at all. But my tractor beam would like pull you through the raindrops. You'd get all wet. I don't think you'd like that, would you? Sai, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Welcome to the alienation. Thank you. I forgot we've also got some more presents in here that we haven't opened up. Whoops. What is this? Rattan Vanity. Oh. Oh, hang on a sec. Put that down again. Let's see. Oh. And eh, not really for me. I'll probably sell that, honestly. We kind of like aliens, you know? Oh, really? You do, do ya? <laughs> really? Is that why you're here? <laughs> you got a type? You like aliens? <laughs> yeah, you? <laughs> hey, oh my god. You guys trying to riz me up right now? What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> alien type. Okay, what about like alien from the movie, the hit movie Alien though? What about that kind of alien? You know? Is that your type? What about, what about the alien from Predator? Furry? No! It doesn't have any fur on it. What are you talking about? They're hot? Hey, yo, okay, maybe you... Maybe it really is your type. Dang. Just any type of alien. Xenomorph is hot? Oh my god. Really? Even with that second mouth? <laughs> you think that's hot? Okay, let's grab these apples back here. Next question! <laughs> The Xenomorph Queen is my waifu? Oh my god. Really? Really? Oh, you guys really are monster fuckers. What the hell? <laughs> Next question! Alright, moving on. Let's see. Have I done this rock yet? <laughs> I know there are a lot of people on the internet who are kinda... kinda into that stuff. Like, actually. You know, to each their own, I guess. Dang. You know? I'm just out here being myself, you guys, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Can we agree that fangs are hot? You like fangs, do you? Really? <laughs> I mean, yeah, fang, you know, fangs are hot. I gotta agree. I gotta agree with that, right? A good character design has sharp teeth. I do agree with that. Uki, thank you so much for the raid! Hello! Hello, Uki. Uki, are you a monster fucker? 
<laughs> Sorry, we're um, we're talking about some interesting stuff right now. <laughs> money! We got the money rock. Let's go. How was your stream, Mookie? Uh, oh. <laughs> Sorry, if that's a bit too uh, personal of a question, you don't you don't need to ask answer it. You know. <laughs> Mama, I thought you sent us to a cozy stream. What's happening? <laughs> Sorry, you guys. Sorry, stargazers. Sorry. <laughs> no, we were just talking about uh, other Ren Vaders uh, might have a type, you know? I mean, well, yes. Hey, yo. Really? Okay, okay. My next question. Uki. A Xenomorph. Smash or pass? Simple question? Yes, no question? S Vanilla, thank you so much for the five gifted. Welcome to the alienation, thank you! Why is everyone in the chat saying smash? You guys, look, I asked Uki, okay? I asked Uki, alright? You guys don't need to go ahead and expose all of yourselves as well. Come on, what the <laughs> Smash. Not everybody saying smash in the chat. <laughs> oh man. I'm choking on air. <laughs> breathe! You need to breathe. Okay. Renvaders, who knows the Heimlich maneuver? Who knows the kiss of life? One of the Renvaders needs it right now. They can't breathe. I know everyone is saying smash, but for me it depends. Oh. It depends? Like on what? What kind of... What kind of things are important in order for it to qualify as a smash? <laughs> is it the second mouth? It's the second mouth, isn't it? Right? Like that's too much. Hmm. I don't know. The second mouth kind of like intimidates people a little bit sometimes. I get it. I get it. <laughs> He's got standards. He does, yeah. You know, everybody's got, you know. The two mouth work better? Oh my god. I don't know if I like this conversation. I'm sorry, it'll probably be over in like two minutes, don't worry. <laughs> okay, let's sell some stuff, shall we? Sell some fruit, let's get some bells. Did I already give this one to Blathers? Hmm... Have you seen their body? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Have you seen their body? What? What? It, it, are you saying that's like a a pro or a con? What are you saying right now? Hang on, Zen, Xenomorph. Okay, let's have a look at the Xenomorph. All right, you guys, let's have a look. The body? Are you saying it's a plus or a, or a negative? What are, what are you saying right now? <laughs> what am I listening to? The tail? I mean, yeah, they kind of got a bit of curves. Yeah. Okay, you know what? Let's just get back into Animal Crossing. This is an Animal Crossing uh, stream. <laughs> Long Locust, I'm pretty sure I have uh, donated that one already. I'm not processing any of it. It's got cur- it does! It's got curves! Renjamin, what? Ugh. Can't I say my thoughts? Come on, you guys, what the heck? You guys were just telling me not to yuck yums before, you know? And I'm not even saying that- I'm not even saying it's a yum to me. I'm just saying that there are curves. That's all I'm saying, okay? <laughs> 9,000 bell- oh, that's good. Let's go. Please, Ren, we have a guest. It's okay. Uki understands. <laughs> Thank you again for the raid, Uki. <laughs> Sorry for the cursed chat. <laughs> that was my doing. Um, okay, let's go. Let's go. And uh, give the snail. Give the snail. You know what? Let's go island hopping. So curious how this uh, topic came up. I think somebody in chat just said that 
Something about aliens or whatever. About being abducted or something. Whoo! There's the snail. Nice. Alright, let's hear about snails, you guys. Snails are weird creatures, aren't they? You know, I don't... It's so weird. When you grow up, and you get introduced to animals and stuff, right? And all these different creatures. You just don't think they're weird, really. You don't... You know what I mean? I feel like... I feel like you get introduced to them, maybe you think they're a little weird at the time, but you just get over it so quickly. And then I feel like later on, when you really think about a creature's existence, you know, like a snail or like an octopus or something, you really start thinking about it more and you're like, these creatures are so, so weird and like, otherworldly. Like, how, how did I ever think this was like a normal animal? You know what I mean? <laughs> I felt that way about, uh, like, yeah, octopi and, like, squids and stuff, and some sea life is just kind of crazy. Right? Oh shit, sorry, I'm not reading. Uh, <clears throat> Snails are mollusks, you see, and are born wearing shells they cannot remove. Instead, their shells get bigger and bigger as they grow. Whew! They must get heavy, don't you know? I suppose that's why they need a trail of mucus to move about a truly foul form of transportation. It's pretty kind of gross, actually, yeah. <laughs> Octopus are smart. Yeah, they're really smart. That's another thing. It's just like, they're so smart. It's, it's kind of crazy. I'm convinced they're not from this planet, you guys. I have seen creatures like them on other planets before. So I'm a little suspicious. All right. Bren, can we go on a snail adventure, please? What, what does that even mean? What's a snail adventure? I mean an adventure to go out in the rain looking for snails? That sounds kind of cute. I'd be down to do that. You know what the worst feeling in the world is, you guys? One of the worst feelings I've ever experienced here on this planet is when it's raining outside and you're walking out in the rain and it's dark and you step and you hear a crunch and you look down and you've stepped on a snail. Oh, I hate when that happens. I feel so bad. Because they can't move, they're so slow. They literally can't get out of the way. And you break their house. You might even you might break their entire life as well. I don't know. Are they are they durable? If you step on a snail, does it a hundred percent die, or are they kind of like, you know? Well, they're squishy, right? Do you think they'd be able to endure that? Ren, that's an Earth life form. I know. Pretty sure they're dead. Oh, fuck. I don't know where that other bug went behind there, but whatever. <laughs> the pain for both the snail and the person. I know. What the heck? I hate it. It's worse than stepping on a Lego, in my opinion. You know? At least stepping on the Lego, the Lego's gonna be fine, you know? <laughs> the snail's not gonna be fine if you crush it. Alright, let's keep getting some of these. <laughs> Once I accidentally ran over a turtle on and the crack has haunted me uh, for years. I bawled my eyes out. Aww. I'm actually, I feel, yeah, I'm, I'm really fortunate. I don't think I've ever you know, accidentally hit something with my car, like an animal, like roadkill and stuff. I would feel so bad. Um, yeah. There is a lot of, unfortunately, there's a lot of 
roadkill in Australia. Oh, what is that? Is that a tick? Yes, I caught a pill bug. Oh, nice. I don't think I've given that to uh, Bladders. So I'll have to give that to him. I thought you ran over a kangaroo before. No, I haven't. Uh, no, I'm, I'm pretty sure I would remember if I uh, did that. No, I, I haven't hit into a kangaroo before, but uh, kangaroos are very common. Um, like roadkill in Australia. It's, it's really sad. Um, yeah, you, you see a lot of them on the side of the road when you're driving on highways and stuff. Pretty upsetting. Um, but yeah, but I think I have told, uh, people on stream that, yeah, if you hit a kangaroo, they can do, um, obviously, you know, like, it's, it's bad for them, but, like, they, they also, they're heavy as well, right? So they'll fuck up your car. And some, you know, a lot of times people will, they'll kind of jump out in front of, uh, the road while people are driving. And they kind of hit into the car, and then they just keep going on like nothing happened, you know? <laughs> like, they're pretty tanky, pretty sturdy, a lot of them. Um, but yeah. They can blindside uh, drivers and stuff in Australia. Easily. Very easily. They're strong. Yeah. They are. <laughs> Whenever I think of strong kangaroo, I just think of those buff kangaroo memes. <laughs> <laughs> you know those pictures? I've never seen a kangaroo that buff before, you guys. I'm just gonna tell you right now. If I, if anybody thinks that's normal in Australia, you know, seeing those, those fucking swole as fuck kangaroos. I haven't seen one like that before, okay? They must be pretty rare or something. I don't know. You only see them at the gym? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> That's right. That's why I probably don't see him, because I, I don't go to the gym. I like... I do like exercise and stuff on my own. I don't know. What do you guys think about gyms and stuff, actually? Do you like going to gyms? Or do you prefer to... Oh, what the hell? What the hell is this thing? Is that a praying mantis? Oh. Yes. I caught a walking leaf. Oh! Okay, I'm definitely, uh, swapping it for something. I'd rather just run around my neighborhood. Oh, yeah. The environment makes you motivated to exercise, uh, more than home, that's for sure. Yeah, I was... I was wondering about that. I feel like... I feel like there'd be something kind of nice exercising while there's, uh... You know, not while there's too many people around, because, um... I don't really like really crowded places. Oh shit, there's a fossil here as well. Yeah, I'm not really into overly crowded places. I don't think many people are. But uh, I don't know. If I went to the gym on a really, you know, quiet time of day or something, I feel like it would be nice. If there were a couple people around exercising and stuff, it would motivate me too. You know what I mean? Hmm. Have you gone to the gym before? I I have tried it, um, uh, like, with some friends and stuff in the past. And I think it was, it was pretty fun, but we never, like, I never stuck to go into the gym like that, you know? Okay, let's do donate these things. Mm -hmm. People in the gym scare me? I don't know why. Why? Why would people in the gym scare you? Is it because, like, are you worried that they'll they'll be judgy or something? Because I think that when it comes to that, honestly, wouldn't people at the gym really be there just for themselves, kind of focusing on their, you know, like, bettering themselves and stuff? They wouldn't really be concentrating on other people, would they? Well, I don't know. I'm not sure, actually. I don't really, I don't really know. Uh, that's all my donations. Whoops. Uh, yeah, that's true. Makes sense. Hmm. What's this one? Uh, 
I'd like to work out in my house recently because it's a little expensive for me. Yeah, that's another thing. Gym memberships and stuff. I mean, <laughs> you know, there's nothing stopping you from exercising at home and in your own, uh, you know, space. So, But I get that a lot of people don't really like going for runs, you know, outside in parks on streets and stuff because, because there's people that, you know, that do watch you, you know, like see you and stuff. And um, I guess, I guess if there's going to be people that are going to be judgy and stuff, it would probably be more so people like that, right? Not people in gyms, because I feel like, yeah, they'd just be doing their own thing. Right? Just a shy human. I mean, my take on it is like, it doesn't matter if people <laughs> are going to look at you or judge you or whatever at all because especially randoms like strangers why why would you for me it's like why would i care about what a stranger thinks of me you know they don't know me they're never going to know me <laughs> you know like and i i don't know i personally wouldn't be very judgy with like you know strangers and people that i met and stuff because i know that that would feel bad, you know? That would feel bad. Oh shit, I gotta let this go. But I think that a lot of people really think that other people care about them a lot more than they actually do. I don't know. That might sound kind of weird, but it's like... It's a, it's a good thing, right? It's a good thing because... Um... Yeah, because then you don't have to worry as much about it. Okay, let's uh, get rid of this. We got another fossil. Uh, I think I've handed these ones in. Get these ones. People overthink. Oh, definitely. Let's sell this uh, this vanity. I didn't like that. The vacuum cleaner. Should we just sell that as well? I'm never gonna vacuum. <laughs> I'm never gonna fucking vacuum. Actually, I really like vacuuming, but we're gonna sell this one. Um, denim cap. Shit, I can put that back on. All right. Look at all the fine things you brought me. But the roaches? That's true, actually. But I can't actually use the vacuum cleaner, see? It's just for show. <gasps> we should put our exercise ball down! Okay. I'm going to... We have 99,000 bells in here. Can't I just put this away? Oh. <laughs> Time to exercise. <laughs> All right. Okay, okay. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna do what uh, that one person said and put the goal pole down at the top of our island. Let's go to the... the the highest point of our island. We'll put the goal pole there. Oops. We should go to the ATM. I should, you're right. We'll do that as well. Oh my god, look at all the weeds up here. Oh, another fossil. Okay, let me grab this. T-Rex T Rex skull. Here we go. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna put the, the gold pole right here. Right here. Where is it? Put it right there. Yeah! Nice! It's beautiful. Now let's go. Yeah! <laughs> Heck yeah, I love it. That was a good purchase. <laughs> Okay, let's get all these weeds. Blech. Not blech for you guys. You guys love them. <laughs> They're delicious for you guys. I'm gonna serve these up in a salad for you guys. Mm -mm -mm. Yum, yum, yum. All right. <laughs> Yummy weeds. 
Ren is the type of person who will buy a Mario light. <laughs> Mario light? Nah, that's not me. Give me a Yoshi light. Give me a Yoshi egg light. <laughs> Yo, that would be awesome, actually. I would love that. You're so right. <laughs> you only buy plushies. <laughs> I've got too many plushies, you guys. Um, We're going to put our money away. I want to do island hopping. Mm. What a delicious five-course meal. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> Kunai, thank you so much for the raid. What the heck? Why is everybody raiding me right today? Holy shit, thank you so much everybody. Kunai, how is your stream? Rat Raid! Rat Raid! Hello! <laughs> you can never have too many plushies, that's true. That is so true. You're right. Actually, no, you definitely can, and I do have too much. Okay, you guys, we got the exercise ball. Let's put the exercise ball right here. Kunai! Hello! How was your stream? Did you have a good time? What did you guys get up to? <laughs> Nakarats, hello. Okay, I'm gonna put... Uh, wait, where did I put it? Where the heck did I put it? Oh, here it is. There we go, we got our exercise ball out. Can I sit on it? Hello, stream is good. I'm so sleepy. We were playing Dinkum. Oh, the, the farming sim? Dinkum? The Aussie one? Was it the Aussie farming sim? Fuck yeah, mate. Fuck yeah. We love to farm here in Australia. We got a thwomp. Should I put the thwomp inside? Oh, mom's cushion. Uh, let's put mom's cushion. What do we want? Oh, we can put mom's cushion over here. Right in the middle of the grass for the... For the renovators. Wait, can I? Oh, I need to be able to touch grass. Here we go, ready? Yeah! There we go. Boop, boop, boop. Touch grass. <laughs> we can put mom's cushion right here for you guys. There you go. If you guys want a nice comfy seat. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna put this away in the storage. Uh, but thank you, Kunai. Thank you again for the raid. Hope you had fun. Uh, we'll put this away. Put this away. Put this away. Where did my stones go? Did I sell them? Okay. Let's put back our denim cap. There we go. <laughs> our weeds, though. Okay, you can... You already had some, all right? We'll save some for later now. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go put a bunch of money... away. Swamp. Nice. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Imagine Ren Vader sleeping on that cushion. Ah, that'd be cute. Oh, what have I got? Got some miles. Let's go. What the hell? Another raid? Mari, thank you so much. What the heck? Mari raid too. Wait, were you? Hang on. Was it a collab? Were you playing Dinkum as well? Oh my gosh. How was your stream? Thank you so much. It's a nice, rainy, cozy day in Animal Crossing today. <laughs> yes, it was a collab. Oh, nice, nice. Dinkum. Fair dinkum, mate. Fuck yeah. Oh, hey, Ren. Hello, hello. I'm looking for folks to participate in a customization workshop. Oh. Customize your creations will make DIY even more fun. Hope you join it. Yo, maybe we can make... Some Aluna outfits or something. Ooh. Are you gonna play Dinkum with me, Ren? Yeah, I want to! I think it'd be fun. We should do, like, Aussie AU collab, Dinkum. That would be fun. Is the game, um... Oh, I need to download the game, though. Aussie collab? Yeah, that would be fun. I am down. I want to. It's so hard to gather all of you. Oh, is it? Oh. <laughs> I have been a little bit, uh, I've been a little bit more offline 
recently. Um, but yeah. I'm down though, I'm down. Once I get a bit more online. <laughs> yeah, you especially check the group chat. Wait, what? <laughs> Hang on, wait, is there... Did you message in it? Oh no. I'm exposed. I'm exposed. Wait, did we say something? Oh, because I don't get to... Uh... You guys, there's a lot of group chats that I haven't left from like a year ago. <laughs> Never mind you replied? Oh. <laughs> what the heck? You put me on blast and I replied. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm like, if I, if I saw a message, I would reply. <laughs> no, I'd be down for Dinkum. I think it'd be a lot of fun. What can you craft in it and stuff? Can you like, can you make a dunny? <laughs> Responsible alien. <laughs> you guys, I'm very, um, I'm very uh, empty headed alien. <laughs> you guys. What is a dunny? You know, a dunny? Where you go take a, uh, where you go see a man about a wallaby. You go fucking... You take a shit. <laughs> it's a toilet, a dunny. You can have a helicopter? Wait, what? That's late game. Oh my god. Holy shit. You can get a helicopter and a farming sim? What the hell? <laughs> the Aussie overflow. That sounds fun. Yeah, I'd be down. Was it just you and um, Kunai today? For a couple more people. Uh, Sorry, Uh, let me... Let me deposit some money. But can I almost... How much money do I have? 100. Let's just... Zero, 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 zero. Let's deposit this much. Nice! And Vanta and Vera. Oh, nice. Cool, cool. Yo, Vanta loves... um These types of games, huh? Alright. Let's... Uh, thwomp... Where should I put the thwomp? Hey, you guys. Hello. Just looking at me. Uh. <laughs> hey, what are you shy about? I'm not clapping for you. What the hell? You take all my money. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I was clapping for Isabel. All right. Let's uh, put the thwomp. Where do we want the thwomp? Maybe it can be like our pet dog. Let's put the thwomp, like, right outside our house. Like here. Alright. <gasps> Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? You are? Yes, you are. Woozy, woozy, woozy. Alright, nice. We got our pet dog out the front, you guys. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm going to donate these thingies. Can you stand under it? No, I tried that before. It's motion activated. Um, so it, if anybody walks by it, it's just like <gasps> comes down. But it doesn't crush you, unfortunately. All right, uh, let's donate some of these things. I think he's angry, Ren. No, he's not angry. He's just hungry. That's all it is. He's hangry. What would, a th what would a thwomp eat? Rocks? Oh, I need to, uh, what's it called? I need to get them assessed, I think. Assess them. I'm all a flutter. Boop, boop. There you go. Can you please check out my fossils, sir? Let's take a closer look. Woo -hoo -hoo. These are rare. T-Rex? T-Rex, T-Rex, T-Rex. Come on. Please. Please be a T-Rex. Stone and metal, maybe? Yeah, maybe he eats that. <laughs> what the hell? Euthen... Euthenorpteron... 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 I'm sure the P is silent, right? 
<laughs> Gamba. <laughs> oh, could it be? I used their... Use their... Hmm? Use their term... Use then or pteron. I never thought I'd lay eyes on such a well-preserved Eusthanopteron. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's learn about it. Uh, 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 wonderful. Uh, now where to begin? <clears throat> the Eusthanopteron is famous for being the link between fish and land animals long before dinosaurs. Here you go, you guys. We used to be one of these. Well, not me. You used to be one of these. It seems to have had long, uh, I mean, strong fins capable of pulling it around areas where water was shallow. When most sea creatures lived in the sea, they dreamed of land. If not for them, we mightn't be here today. Imagine if we'd not left the oceans. How might fashion and music be different in an aquatic world? How would we resolve differences? Perhaps some sort of ink squirting contest of chat. Hey, yo. Blat. What the hell? And and there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? <laughs> okay. Ink squirting competition. Alright. Let's make a donation. Ren, don't make it sus. Oh, sorry. My bad. Uh, a Diplo pelvis. Ooh, hoo, hoo, could it be? A Diplo pelvis. All right, tell me about its pelvis, please. Wonderful. Okay, good old Diplo, Diplodicus, Diplodicus, Diplodicus. What would we do without you? Stout fellow embodied all the best dinosaurs. Those sturdy legs, that magnificent tail, and above all, the extraordinary neck. Did you know that it's the center of gra- Wait, did you know that its center of gravity was such- that sitting up on its hind legs was probably easy. What's more, paired with its long neck, this ability greatly increased its reach for eating plants. There you go, Ren Vaders. That's the dream. Eating all that grass. Best of all, Diplodocus probably grew its entire life having no adult size. Oh, would that we were also gifted. Oh my gosh, it just kept growing and growing. Dang. Expand. Uh, that's everything. Nice. The alien nation dream. Okay, you guys. I want to use the Nook Miles ticket. So let's do it. Let's go on a little adventure. And then I think uh, I might think about wrapping up this dream. Because I'm feeling a little... Blech. Okay. Let's keep going. Um, let's go down. Do I need any of uh Yeah, I need everything here. Ladder? Do I need that? Probably. Let's do it. Okay. <clears throat> Wanderer mode? Yes. Alright. Here we are at Dodo Airlines. Hello, Mr. Dodo. <clears throat> hey, hey, hey! Welcome to your one and only gateway to the skies, the Alienation Airport! Bah! How can I help you today? I want to fly! Roger! Okay, I'm gonna do, uh, use Nook Miles ticket. Let's do it! Sure. I'm ready to get you in the sky this minute. Let's just check. You all packed? Tools all ready? Time for takeoff! I think we're good. Do I need anything else? I don't know, maybe I'm forgetting something. <laughs> Look at him panicking as he's like... <laughs> Dodo 1, this is Dodo Tower. Wilbur, do you copy? Got a walker who needs wings over. Roger, ready when you are. Okay, have a good friend flight! Wait, fr good flight friend! And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? What would dodos do? They would go extinct. <laughs> I don't think that's very good advice. <clears throat> Alright, we are two down and docked at the target island. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar, is go. 
Meanwhile, I'll be holding in a- wait, in a holding pattern. Get in touch. Alright, go get a lot of shit. Hopefully you get a good villager. Bye-bye. <laughs> Alright. Come on. There's gotta be a cool villager here. Can we get a good villager? I really want a good villager. Alright, it's a good thing I brought the ladder. <laughs> I was actually thinking about leaving that behind. Okay. Hello? Any villagers? I'm gonna get these apples. Oh, one of them disappeared. Hello? No one? No villagers? What the heck? Are there seriously none? I think you need a plot first. Oh, I see. Okay, then we're just resource collecting then. Alright. We'll do some fishing. It's alright. Do some fishing. Oh, that's a big boy. Look at this guy. Oh, give me a sec. Let me... There we go. Okay. Come on, little guy. Come on. Oh! Gotcha! Nice. Oh! I don't think I've got this one. A king salmon. Checkmate. <laughs> nice. Okay, that was good. That's a good find. Wait, why am I picking up the weeds? We don't need any more weeds on alienation. I'm sorry, renovators. No more weeds. No more. <laughs> I know you guys love them. Your favorite snack. Look at this little guy. Ready? Three, two, one. No weeds. What's this guy? Crucian carp. Oh, okay, we got this one before. Catch this butterfly. <laughs> Why? You've already been fed today, okay? Don't complain. Alright, no complaining. Or you can wait in the seaplane. Alright, what have we... We got these rocks. See if we can get some money. Some money. Okay. Fuck! I missed. <laughs> you didn't see anything, okay? Bah! Okay. Some more iron. Iron, please. Thank you. More. Okay, that was pretty good. Nice. Didn't see nothing. <laughs> That's right, that's right. Alright. You guys, I wanna go camping. I wanna go camping sometime. I miss camping. Oh, here he goes. Oh! That's quick. Oh, what's this one? I caught a sweet fish. Oh, we've got this one before. Okay. Eh? Where'd they go? Oh, they all swam away. Okay, never mind. Oh, here they are. The perfect cast. Oh my god. <laughs> He's so tiny. What is this guy? A rainbow fish. Where's my pot of gold? Oh my god, it's a Niji Sanji fish. Holy shit. Beautiful. Alright, let's go up and get some more rocks. Money? Money rock? No? No? Okay, ready? Three, two, one! Nope. Just a regular old rock. Not the goofy ones. What's Goofy say? What is the... What is the perfect cast that Goofy says? Can't remember how it goes, it's like... It's like... Quarter to three. Quarter to blah. I'm a little teapot and wind up and let her fly! Hang on, I'm gonna Google it actually. The perfect... Cast. <laughs> Goofy... Movie. Quote. Yeah, that's good. Did you guys watch that uh, that movie? Oh, here it is. Okay, ready? <clears throat> he goes like this. Wait, get, let me get let me let me get my goof on right here. I said, 
<clears throat> Glars. <laughs> yep. All right. Here we go. Now, 10 o'clock, 2 o'clock, <laughs> quarter to 3. Toward. How do you say that? Is, is that French? What the fuck, Goofy? <laughs> Toward. Just. Just. How the hell do you say that? Poor jet jet. How do you pronounce this? Pronounce. How to pronounce tor jet jet What does that even mean? I don't even know what that means. French goofy. Should I ask Zally? <laughs> Should I just message Zally and be like, hey, Zally, what does this mean? <laughs> it's this, you guys. This is what it is. Poor jet. How do you even pronounce that? Jet. 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 I don't know. Imagine Zally seeing this message. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna message him right now. The Zallius. Bandage. Hey, Zally. What does mean? Okay. Is it French? It is French, right? <laughs> it looks French. <laughs> Zally, you cute. <laughs> Do you know what? Do you know what that means? Okay, there we go. I messaged him. <laughs> He's gonna be like, what the fuck? It means french fries? No, it doesn't. You're trolling me. What the fuck? It doesn't mean french fries. Stop trolling me, okay? Alright, well, I'll skip that part, alrighty? <clears throat> now, 10 o'clock, 2 o'clock, quarter to 3, something in French, twist, Pasta do he does French again! Oh, I'm a little teapot! Then wind up and let her fly! The perfect cast. Ding! <laughs> uh, that's a good movie. I like that movie. This <laughs> is something in French. <laughs> Dude, why is why is Goofy Why does he say two things in French though? I don't know. He took ballet. Oh, yep. Yeah. Well, he's doing the moves, actually. That kind of makes a little bit of sense. <laughs> Anyways, okay, let's continue on. Sorry about that. Uh, let's see. The perfect chaos. That's such a good movie, you guys. If you haven't seen that movie before, and you like Disney movies, you'll like a goofy movie. I can? What the hell is this? Empty can could. Oh, okay. At least I can make something out of it. It's a ballet move. It basically means a turnaround to go around. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. Because he's doing all these fancy moves while he's winding up for his, <laughs> for his perfect cast. Is there anything else we want on this island? I don't know. This island is kind of a nothing island, huh? Hmm. Oh, we're getting some coconuts and stuff. Consider the coconuts. Consider the trees. The island gives us what we need. And no one leaves. Right here you'll stay. There you are. You'll be okay. Learn just as I did. I cannot cast for this... This fit. What is this? Consider. There we go. It's a big boy. Come on. Come on. Gotcha. Oh my. Holy. What the? F a swordfish. I c Wait, a blue marlin. Holy shit, that's gonna poke someone's eye out. Listen to this fish. It's got a good point. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright. That was big. He was big. Oh! Is that a paper kite? Look at this. Ready? 
Gotcha. There it is. Yep. Paper kite. There you are. I've been staring at the edge of the water long as I can remember. Never really knowing why. Dude, that movie has got great music. I love it. I know everybody on this island has a role on this island. So maybe I can roll with mine. What are these two fish? These two fish in love? Look at them. Side by side. I'm about to break them up, you guys. I'm about to break them up. Love is a lie. Come here. Come here. Yeah! <laughs> Got him. Oh, another King Salmon. Nice. I'm gonna sell that one. <laughs> Ren, what the hell? <laughs> Evil Ren. Well, I am a pescatarian, you guys. That makes me sad, actually. <laughs> God. Okay, uh, let's see. What's this? Lecture hall desk. Wait. I want to see it. Drop item. It won't let me drop it on here? I can't place it down. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see what that looks like back home. Dun, 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 dun. I see a big fish up there. That's my next destination. You guys, we're just on a nice little fishing trip. That's all it is. Enjoy the relaxing sound of the waves. The rays of the sun. Get a nice tan. Or a nice summer. If you don't tan. Very nice. See bass? See base? Should I be collecting flowers? I don't think so. I already got flowers back at our place. <laughs> Ine. Oh. Alright, what's up here? You could get the roses. Okay, might as well. We gotta try to fit it, uh, to fill our pockets somehow, so. Okay, let's grab all these. Wait, there's bubbles! I forgot that I can swim. Oh, I don't have my swimmers, though. Oh, no. I don't have my swimmers. Shit. Would you consider getting a tan? Uh, I don't know if I tan. <laughs> I think I just burn. I don't really, uh... Yeah, I don't tan. Oh, what's that butterfly? Have we gotten this one before? I don't think we have. Jump! Get free. And go! Have you ever went swimming before? Yeah, I like swimming. Uh, let's swap this one with... The sticks. We don't... Why do we have sticks? I don't know. Oh! Another big one. Ready? Okay. Come on, come on, come on. I think I've already got this one. Olive flounder. Uh, let's swap it with... We don't need the can. <laughs> I know that we had a recipe out of it, but we don't need that recipe. I don't think. Okay, what about this one? I love swimming. Mmm. Swimming's fun. I like it. Alright. Uh, can we swap it for something? What do we want to get rid of? We got rocks. We don't need rocks. Okay, let's see. Not you rubbishing the ocean? Oh shit, you're right. 
It's okay, you guys. This is a game. I would never do it in real life, okay? Would never do it. I would never litter. Actually, that's one thing that I that I never do. Actually. Never litter. Wait, actually, I have littered once. Okay? You guys, I was once, I was driving my car. Okay? I was driving my car, I was on, on a road trip. And I couldn't stop, alright? And I had an apple. I had an apple, okay? Was it an apple? Oh wait, no! It was a banana, okay? I had a banana, alright? And I, and I ate the banana. Okay, and it was gonna be a long time before I made it to, you know, a, a place with a, with a trash can, you know? So I was driving. And it was, it, it was literally, it was country. It was country road and stuff, right? Okay, and I was like, yeah, you know, the banana, it's, it's biodegradable, you know, and like animals will come and they'll eat it. So I threw it out my window, okay? I threw it outside, all right? It wasn't on the road though, okay? Don't worry. It was out on the thing. And then some birds all flew down and they ate it. Well, okay, I don't know that. I don't know that, but I just assumed that it would be like that, you know? <laughs> Real Mario Kart moment. The whole banana. No, not the whole banana. Like, I ate... You know, it was a banana peel, you know? But, like, the animals eat that, right? That's not healthy for the environment? It isn't?! Wait, are you serious? Tell me you're joking. Tell- shame on you, friend. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna call the cops. What? The ruse probably ate it. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, right? I mean, banana isn't acidic, so maybe it's okay. <laughs> if it's not organic, then it's bad. Well, I would never throw like, uh, you know, like plastic or anything like that. That was the only time I ever did it. It was because I was in the middle of nowhere, you know? The alien threw a banana peel on the road. No, I didn't throw it on the road, okay? I didn't want anybody to, you know, to slip on it and lose some coins, you know? And then fall off the edge, and then Lakitu would have to pick them back up, you know? I didn't want that. I used banana peels to fertilize my plants and fruit and trees. Yeah, that's- well, that was- that was my thinking. I don't know. Maybe it was silly. I'm calling NASA right now. <laughs> NASA couldn't find me if they tried, okay? <laughs> what are NASA gonna do? Jeez. Oh man. I use them around my rose bushes? Mmm. Was it appealing? God damn it. I see what you did there. Okay, what do we want? We've we've got a lot of stuff right now. Uh let's get I don't think that these are worth very much, right? It's a fucking dragonfly. I'm gonna catch this guy. I'm gonna catch this guy. Yeah, you guys, so that was my one, that was my one litter bug moment, you know, and my Mario Kart moment as well. It was messed up, I know. Okay, but I didn't, I, I honestly thought that, you know, it would be, you know, that it would be good for the environment. Maybe, maybe that was copium. Okay, let's see, uh, I think that's pretty much everything. The flowers. Get the roses. We'll fill up our pockets with the roses and then we'll get on. Get back on the road. Wait, have I done this rock? I don't think I have. Oh! Drop it. Okay, here we go. It's biodegradable. Yeah! Oh. Okay, ready? Three, two, one! What is it? Oh, it's iron again. He loves Nintendo so much he applies it to real life. You guys know that they, uh, don't they? In Japan, don't they have those, like, um, Mario Kart go karts that you can hire out or something? But weren't they. Weren't they complain? Didn't people complain about it because they were on the actual busy streets and stuff? I thought I heard something about something like that. 
I didn't mean to pick that one up. I think in Akiba. Yeah, I think I heard something about that. No, stop picking up the weeds! Drop it. Drop it. I feel like that song was like a bunch of YouTubers intros <laughs> like like five years ago or something <laughs> What were some other songs that everybody used for intros uh, on YouTube? A long time ago. There was another one, it was like, um... Is it like the Sonic the Hedgehog's... Sonic the Hedgehog song that's like... Do you know that one? And it was like all crazy epic. <laughs> and I'd click on a YouTube video and it would play that song and I'm like, Damn, holy shit, what have I gotten myself in there? This is so intense. You mean before copyright? Yeah, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> um, alright, I think we are good with stuff. I'm gonna go back. Yeah, let's go. Bell bottom, new wave, this is stovetop hand mirror. Do you require assistance? Over. I'm ready to go home. You're ready to go home, huh? Hope you got a good haul. Yep, let's go. Roger, get the hell in my plane. Get in the chopper. Get in the chopper. Get in the chopper. What are you doing? Get in the chopper. All right. Thank you, Squidward. Thank you, SpongeBob. Get in the chopper. Put the cookie down. <laughs> I love Arnie. He's so funny. Dude, what is uh? Whenever whenever Christmas comes around, I'm always like uh. <laughs> I always want to watch Jingle All the Way. You know that Christmas movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger? <laughs> it's so funny. It's such like a B-grade Christmas movie too. Like it's a, it's not like. Well, I don't know. It's like fun. It's fun, so I like it. Jingle all the way. Okay, let's make a donation. I've only watched it once years ago. It's really... It's so weird, man. Such a weird movie. Okay, let's uh, donate. Do we want to hear the descriptions? Let's just donate them. I care more about dinosaur stuff, honestly. Ugh. I'm feeling kind of bad. I think I'm gonna end this stream. I don't know what he's saying, I'm not reading. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Bring us to the aquarium? I'll take you guys on an aquarium date sometime, okay? Not today though, what am I doing right now? Sorry. All right, let's see who we got. I think wait, this is everything, right? Sorry, my brain is not working right now. Okay, hang on. Uh, there's nothing we can accept. Okay, that's good. Then we will leave. <laughs> Whoopsie. Okay, let's go sell all of this stuff. Do we want the flowers and stuff? We can put a, bud, a bit of flowers down here. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> I don't want to put it like that. Can I plant it? No? Wait, how do I... Do I need to, like, bury it or something? No. Bury and hold? No, that's not it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, never mind. You know what? We'll just go sell them. That's oh, one of those leaf guys again. I can sell you. Okay, let's go. 
Oh, hit this guy as well. So you guys, I'm fading. <laughs> All right, time to sell to me, Tommy. Oh, wait, I could get those apples. Oh, fuck it. Who cares? Hello. Blue sugar high. I want to sell. What will you buy? I, 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 I am gonna sell this and this and... Mm, no, I'm gonna keep that. Lecture hall desk, I'll keep that. Keep this, 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 this. Should I get rid of the flowers? Do you think the flowers sell for much? <laughs> then pay the debt? Yeah, good idea. And then we'll end the stream there. Mm-mm-mm. -hmm. Not really, they don't sell for very much. Okay, then I'm not. Not the blue fish. What? This one? The king salmon? I think I already gave that one to uh, Blathers, so I think we're good. Right when you said sugar, it reminded me of the song Watermelon Sugar. <laughs> Watermelon Sugar. I'm gonna eat your horns now. No, you will not, actually. Thank you very much. Okay, run the numbers. 9,000? Okay, pretty good. I'll take that. Nice. Alright, we got some miles as well. Where are our miles? There they are. Pick of the bunch. <laughs> uh, let's see. I thought you did not since uh, I've never been in the aquarium. No, no. Uh, let's see. Did I get anything else? Oh yeah, there it is. Alienation icons. Oh, we got one for the music, the, the melody. Cute. How much are we in debt? Uh, don't think about it. Uh, don't worry about it, okay? <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go. Go pay off our debt. How do I get another plot of land? So I can invite more villagers. Do I talk talk to Nook about that, maybe? Alright. Good work, Isabel. You're doing a lot of hard work back there. Construction consultation. Explain the services. In addition to my normal duties, I can also talk about issues related to island construction. Lots of fun projects. I can help with building bridges or inclines and ramps and stairs. Removing existing buildings. Okay. These are optional extras for your island experience, so these services will of course incur additional fees. And with that information in mind, what do you think? How can I be of assistance to you? I need your help. Time to jump into action. What should I do? Uh, this is the construction. Wait, what? Oh, here we go. About my workshop, about my home, let's talk infrastructure. About that workshop. Wait, what? What is this about again? Customization. Oh, yeah, the customization. Uh, let's do that some other time, actually. Pay them or you'll be broke forever. <laughs> okay, I'll pay off the remaining bells that I got here. Ready, you guys? Let's make a payment. Pay from pockets. Yeah. How much we got? 20. Six, five, one. There we go. 71,000 bells remaining. That's not too bad, okay? We got it down pretty pretty good. Uh, let's see. Little by little. Yay! <laughs> oh my god, we are so broke. Don't think about it, okay? Alright, it was worth it for the house expansion. Right? You want a big house, don't you? <laughs> it was worth it, right? Totally. Alright, you guys. I think I'm gonna end the stream here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I will I will thank uh, Super's probably in the next stream. Oh! Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Would you, would you? Yeah, we got a pet now. What's his name? It's Rex. This is a, this is our pet, Rex. Wait, wait, good boy, Rex.
Alright, you guys, thank you again so much. And I'm gonna I'm gonna head off. I'm going to raise somebody because man, I got so many raids today. What the heck? People are so kind. Hi Neko, thank you so much for the super. I appreciate it. Sai, thank you so much. Scarlet is currently live right now, so wait, is she? Is she? Wait, it says she's alive. Wait, is there nobody live right now? Eh? Otsuren, thank you for today. Thank you guys so much as well. And, uh... <clears throat> yeah, I'll see you guys soon. I'm gonna try to... I'm gonna try to... Uh, feel a lot better and stuff and look after myself. I've been taking a lot of medicine and stuff, but I don't know. I don't know if it's really working. Um, let me do a raid if we if there is somebody. Is there? Oh, Vanta. Wait, Vanta is live. Wait, Vanta is live? Huh? Vanta Crow. Bringer. Wait, I just had. <laughs> I just had such a dumb moment just then. I typed in Vanta's name, but I, t I typed it Vanta is his first name and Crowbringer is his last name together. It's Vanta Crow. But I need some rest. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna send you guys over to Vanta Crow. Which is his name. <laughs> it's not it's not Crowbringer. Why did I think it was Crowbringer? He's the Crowbringer. No no no. Wait. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Alright, enjoy the stream, you guys. Uh, and I'll see you very soon, okay? <laughs> Kat, thank you so much for the last minute, Supa. He brings the crows. <laughs> he does. Alright, you guys. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. And, uh, wooshu wooshu. And, um, I will see you guys soon, okay? Take care of yourselves, alright? Bye-bye. See you later. Thank you. Bye.